Hello everyone. Welcome to this video. Today, we are tackling a common and frustrating error in Windows 11, the device is disabled, code 22, message. This error means your operating system has turned off a hardware device. It could be anything from a USB device to an internal component. Don't worry, it's usually fixable. We will walk through several simple steps to get your device working again. Let's dive right in with our first set of solutions. First, let's try some basic troubleshooting. A simple restart can often fix many temporary glitches. Just restart your computer and see if the device becomes active again. If it's an external device, like a printer or a USB drive, double check its physical connection. Make sure the cables are securely plugged into both the device and your PC. Try a different USB port if available. Sometimes, a loose cable is the only problem. Next, we will use Device Manager. This is a powerful tool in Windows for managing your hardware. To open it, right-click on your Start button. Then, select Device Manager from the list. Once Device Manager opens, look for the device that is showing the code 22 error. It might have a yellow exclamation mark next to it. Expand the category where your device is located. For example, if it's a USB device, look under Universal Serial Bus Controllers. Right-click on the problematic device. If you see an option to enable device, click it. This is the most straightforward fix. If the device is already enabled, try disabling it first, then re-enabling it. This can often refresh the connection. If enabling doesn't work, let's try updating the driver. Right-click on the device again. Choose Update Driver. Then, select Search Automatically for Updated Driver Software. Windows will try to find and install the latest driver. If that doesn't help, you might need to uninstall the device. Right-click on the device and select Uninstall Device. Confirm your choice. After uninstalling, restart your computer. Windows will usually detect the device during startup and reinstall its driver automatically. This often resolves corrupted driver issues. Sometimes, a recent change to your system can cause this error. In such cases, a system restore might help. Search for Create a Restore Point in the Windows search bar. Open the System Properties window. Click on the System Restore button. Follow the on-screen prompts to choose a restore point from before the error started appearing. This will revert your system settings without affecting your personal files. For more advanced users or specific devices, checking your BIOS slash UEFI settings might be necessary. Restart your PC and press the appropriate key to enter BIOS slash UEFI setup. This key is often F2, Delete, F10, or F12, depending on your computer's manufacturer. Look for settings related to integrated peripherals or USB configuration. Ensure that the device type you are having trouble with is enabled in the BIOS. Be careful not to change other settings unless you know what you are doing. Save your changes and exit. Your PC will restart. We hope these solutions help you fix the device's disabled, code 22, error. It can be a very annoying problem, but usually, one of these steps will get your hardware back on track. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you found this information helpful, please give it a big thumbs up. Leave a comment below if you have any questions or if you found another solution that worked for you. Sharing this video with others who might be facing the same issue would be greatly appreciated. Your support helps us create more helpful content like this. See you next time.